We return to George Bolet's Master Class. In other words, allow the flute and the oboe and the clarinet and the and the and the horn really. That's fine, but I think you're taking a little bit too much time for the resolution. See if you... that here you really want to make quite a come down mm -hmm. hmm? yes. all right but in order to to have that have any kind of meaning hmm, you have to do the other ones in a very positive manner <laughs> really drive it up to the resolution so that you can do the reverse and make the the negative accent on the other one. Play for it. Ira Levin. 21-year-old Jose Fegali comes from Brazil, where he began studying the piano at the age of four. When he was eight, he made his concert debut, having won the Brazilian Symphony Orchestra competition. He came to London in 1976 and won numerous prizes at the Royal Academy of Music, which he followed up with successes at several international competitions. At the 1978 Queen Sophia International Competition in Madrid, he took second prize, first prize and the Outstanding Artist Award at the 1980 International Young Artist Competition in Tunbridge Wells, and first prize again in the 1982 Dudley Piano Competition. Unlike Ira Levin, he's never studied with George Bonnet, and several different points emerged from his interpretation of the same movement. with an orchestra, what you just did. Take a little more time. You have to continue absolutely mm -hmm. the same tempo. Mm -hmm. All right, go ahead. Yeah, all right. But if, if you're going to do that, you, you really have to, have to do it more, more definite. I know what you're trying to do, mm -hmm. but uh, the listener wouldn't wouldn't know exactly what you were, or at least what you're trying to do. You're not 
really conveying to the listener. Hmm? You're trying to do... If you'll do a little more and, and, and if you do this... Hmm? Mm -hmm. You know, kind of really detached and secco, dry, then really do that real wet, you know, mm -hmm. use, use pedal, mm -hmm. play there. Yeah, all right. That'll be doubly effective if you will do the secco much more pianissimo. Yeah, all right. See if you can do it even more detached. Good. to be very, very difficult for a conductor to be able to follow you. Mm -hmm. I recall Rachmaninoff solving that problem by doing this, really quite firm, you know, a real jump, bump, bump, really accented. And mm -hmm. that really tells the conductor exactly where you are. Yeah, mm -hmm. the tempi I'm going to go in with. conductor and then another thing you can tell the conductor and this might might be a help to him and that is that you do the alargando hmm? but the but the a tempo the back to a tempo starts on the fourth beat of that measure right in other words take a little more time for that yeah, yeah take a take a, a little more more time between the little 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 George Bolet's Master Class will continue in